challenge to youth. This girl met the challenge from an invalid chair. For seven years, 18-year-old Mary Anderson has been a fighter against paralysis. She wanted to prove to herself and to everyone like her that life could still be full and thrilling. From her home in Sunderland, she began a journey, her first, to London. Nearly 300 miles on the road alone. Wave and a cheery word from passers-by and her journey goes on. She'd heard all about London, the lights and grand sights, and she wanted to see for herself. The world's full of people who grouse and grumble, people who can't see any future in things, who can't get along. Mary Anderson is not one of these. Listen to the girl who made an adventure of her determination to stand on her own two feet. The, the machine was going very well all this time. Was it comfortable? Very comfortable and running easily, you know. Mm -hmm. Much better than I thought it would be. Really. Mm -hmm. uh, from Doncaster I went on to Peterborough and I was welcomed into the town by the mayor. Oh, that was nice. Yes, the beadle mm -hmm. showed me around the town hall. It was very mm -hmm. interesting. Mm -hmm. And then uh, nothing really very much happened until I got into London after Peterborough. Well, from what I've seen of London so far, I think it was uh, well worth the trip. I've been to the Tower and Downing Street, Kensington Gardens, Regent Zoo. Oh, and Beckingham Palace, I've always wanted to see that. Uh, I did think the traffic might be a little bit difficult, but all the drivers seemed quite expert, and everyone made way for me, right, as they have done through the uh, whole trip, you know. So it was all very nice.